I could do with the one at uh, Kaelid, but that one I can't, I think. So that elevator going down looks like it's going to take us to the left. Into a tunnel, perhaps? Yeah, I can see that I could spawn ashes, so that is a magma worm. Similar to the one that we fought on the coward's rat, as the crone called it. That's cheating. Shit. Do as much DPS as I can. Another dragon heart. Did you see how many runes that gave me? Must be a very small number. That's not where I just came from. I'm about to die. I thought that may have taken me to that item that I saw, but no, I think we have to cross the lava to get to that. Where the hell am I? Oh, there was a path over there. Okay, okay, okay. I get it. I almost don't need to take the elevator down there. Was it really worth it? Uh, I'd say yes. Those are pretty rare. Okay, so where else can we explore? We can have a look at the roofs of the prison town and see what we've missed here. But after that, I think all we can do is maybe start doing some of the assassination missions. Does that guy remain dead? He does not. He respawned. He was guarding a plus seven somber stone. So we've been down there. I am mindful of the fact that there's a set of stairs around there which we've not seen. Or rather we've seen them but we haven't traversed them. Come here you. sure I can make that jump.
Did I completely miss that path earlier? Yeah, okay, there's a whole section... Ah, oh, I see. I see, I see, I see. So I've been there, and then I crossed over to that building there, but there was a set of stairs leading down. I've not been down these stairs. Speaking of stairs, where were they? They were jutting out. There they are. Not while I'm standing on the edge of, edge of a building looking. I... Okay, wait, wait, wait. That way, perhaps? Yeah, okay. Could maybe go down there, but that's risky. That is a jump and a half, assuming that I can make that. I don't think I can. Especially not if I jump like that. Right, I'm down here now. Wasn't a complete waste of time. Is that Alexander? No, it is not. I could target him, so I assume he's hostile. Shit. I'll check that out later if I remember. Ah, shit. Is this going to return me to where I dropped? Oh shit, that's death. Can I teleport out here? Nope, the map is not accessible. Alright, I think we'll just slowly trudge through this lava. Maybe I can make the jump up there. No, that's too high, that's way too high. That's where we initially dropped, correct? Honestly, my character is so dumb. I would think that those flames would necessitate more of a quick hustle than, you know, just trudging through like this. But no, let's just slowly walk through it, take chip damage, drink a potion every now and then, which are extremely limited. Oh, hey. Ah, I should be moving faster than that. That's all I'm saying. It's like I'm wading in knee-deep water there, but no. I'm just soaking my feet in lava. Thank you. Alright, let's try that jump again, except this time I'll have sprints held. Oh god. Please screw that up. There we go. We can go up to our left. Not sure why I'd want to jump on that wall over there, but okay. This is not exactly where we landed before, but it's close. It's right there. So I tried to make that jump and failed in spectacular fashion. Alright, let's explore around here, see if there isn't another way down. And then I think I'll call it quits for tonight. Oh, hey. Another one of these fucking omen killers. That is absolutely murdering me. Yeah, we're 
almost on the ground level, I think. Sword and that is a weapon. Scars with faith. Forty faith. Even though the Elden Ring is shattered and the Earth Tree has dulled from its former radiance? Really? Earnest faith continues to hold the answers. The Earth Tree has faded. It was more brilliant than what it currently looks. That's... Well, that's something. Right, being that way. Drop down there. This is the base of the stairs that I was talking about earlier. I was going to ask what that scorching sound is, but there, that is a mechanical sound, and that is the sound of one of those twin chain blade things. All right, can I get down to? No, I can't. Do I really have to make that jump? I really have to make that jump. No, never mind, it wasn't a mechanical sound. No, never mind, I'm talking bullshit. Hey, you. Just casually fighting this fucking thing on a roof. That's so we have poison bombs dropped on me. Oops. Survive that. Not sure if I'll survive the follow-up attacks, however. Can't see shit. I knew that was coming, but I couldn't see it. Couldn't see it, couldn't maneuver. It's basically got me cornered. Just the briefest of moments, I'm thinking about leaving a message here. That's not going to happen because I'm not a troll. Alright, it is getting pretty late where I am, so I think what I'll do is make one last attempt to make this jump. And then I will respawn further up and check out the rest of Prison Town a bit later. Can I make that? It's really close. It's really close, but I don't see any other way to get there. No. That is a bridge too far. It's a purple item though, so it makes me think there's something really, really good there. I'll go back up and take a look from the bridge side. I could maybe reach it from that roof, but I'm pretty sure the awning is covering all of those stairs.
Right, where can I go? I might have to go all the way back to the start to get over there, maybe. Unless I can go here. Oh, God. I'll come over here. That didn't kill you? Really? Wow. So my runes are... Up there. How do we get up there? I don't even remember how I got up there. Too many. Oh, these things are so annoying. to go for the quick finish there, but nothing doing. How do I actually get back up to that, onto that roof? Okay, we do it from up here. Yeah, because I was trying to test to see if there was a way down on the stairs, but I was trying to make that jump across those roofs, and it turns out there's no need to do so. We can just go this way. The awning is completely covering these stairs. And it's depressing because I can see that there is a purple poop on there. I can't make the jump from over there. And from what I can tell, I don't believe I can make this jump. It is a fraction too far. And by a fraction, I mean that's going to get me killed. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. We could potentially go up onto that ledge. Better take him out just in case. Just in case he decides to follow me. So somehow I got on the right hand side. Never mind. So what was all that for? Went to all this effort to get this thing, and what is it? It is a... I thought it would be one of those. Love it. Alright, let's take one last look in this area, but I might actually be done at Prison Town. You 
You're not blocking at that time. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm done with those houses there. We still have the tower where we use the stone sword keys where I haven't uh, picked up half of the stuff though. Uh, let's go up that little walkway. Are there three of them here? Yes. Man Serpent's Shield. That is likely going to be a small shield which provides me very little protection whatsoever. Am I right? Of course I'm right. Said to have been tempered in lava, it boasts great resistance to fire. Does it really? I mean, this thing appears to work better, but it requires faith. Resists frost with its heat and can even be used to deal fire damage if wielded as a weapon. Hmm. Nice. There's definitely something else down there on like a walkway. There it is, right there. Pretty sure that building's been cleared. There was nothing else in... Yeah, there was a... Um, we went up the ramp. We need to use a stone sword key to get inside there. We did. We cleared out that tower. I don't feel that I'm missing anything now in this little nook. I'm not going after you again because you're likely to kill me. Oh, can I see it? Well, let's grab this one and then what I might do is teleport back to the church and start investigating around the area where we used the stone store keys. Alright, I think I'm done here. Let's go in the church. If I can find it. Christ, that's so confusing. That's a guest hall. Yep, okay, that's, that's the building I was just looking at saying it's been cleared, so we're going here. So the next question is, how do we get back to that tower? I believe it was this way. We have to go up here. Nothing down there. We've been in there. That's a grab. And that's a death. That way, that's the first tower. We've been down there and cleared that out. There was a cell down there with a cookbook. God. You are lucky, sir. That's all I can say. I mean, you're dead now, but you were lucky. 
Alright, note to self, don't stay near these things when they explode. Come here, you. So, was there potentially something down there? Or oh, no, it was the next one. If I can find it. That whip. Just casually arc ramming through that lava. Is there potentially something down there? That's the longest of long shots and it's a fair walk back, but you know what? I'm gonna take a look. There is. Oh god. There's a lot of these death dudes here. No, 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 hit it, please. Thank you. The lava's not hurting these guys. Nice. Worth it. Very much worth it. Can't just go all the way back here. Wow, okay. Uh wasn't expecting that. I think I can hear another one to my left. Just hearing things. Panicking over nothing. Oh, have I been in here? Yes, I have. That was up here, and here was the ladder. nothing that way. I remember that much. We get into this small church here where we've got a few dudes to fight. Just got to avoid the head and go for the fleshy parts. Alright. What do we do in here? That's just above where we hope we were. That's nothing. I might start by seeing if I can take out this guy on the far side. If I ever find my bow. Is there anything better that I can use here, actually? 
EDD. Maybe it's worth leveling that up. I'm not sure. It uses somber smithing stones. That's the only thing that's giving me pause. Although I guess I can always purchase uh, one, two, three, and four, can't I? Or I can purchase something at least. Maybe I can do that. But yeah, we've got a door there. I don't know how to reach that. That looks way too far down, but I'm going to try once from here. Oh, shit. Okay. Anything nice? It's like an unused wing of the manor or something. That's crazy though, I didn't even take damage from that fall. And yes, I did call it a fall and not a jump because that's what I feel it's classed as. Okay. Oh, okay, I see. Came from there, fell down there, now I'm here. And this leads me to where I was being sniped. The dagger talisman. Somehow I don't think that was worth it. From here, it looks like my way is down. Okay, the dude that was sniping me is directly below me. We could have also gone on that beam. But I've been there from memory. I've been there. I've been on the beam. We went down those three cages, jumped on the beam, and then I sort of got lost. Alright, so we have something below us as well. Nice. Alright, what is my reward? Another stone saw key? Yeah. Decent consolation prize. So at this point... I think we might have explored everything. Yeah, this was the jump where I got lost. I didn't know where to go. And that's going to lead us down into the area with the four Albanorix. We've explored that area pretty thoroughly. I'm not going to make that jump again because there is no need to do so. Let's teleport back here and have a chat to Tanith. And I'm also going to take a look outside at that building that we can't access. I killed Rykard. Do you have any comments for me? You. It's true then. You've defeated our lord. Am I excommunicated? No. no. I must thank you. Our lord was yet weak. You have taught us that. Defeat is not the end. Our lord is immortal. And will one day rise again. Stronger. Until then. I must stay the path, and do my part. I will leave the Volcano Manor before long. I suggest you do the same. I will miss these encounters. The champion who walks the tainted path shines all the more. I always was an admirer. But I just got here. This is farewell. Perhaps we will meet again along the path. Just like Granny. This is perhaps 
Speaking of, did we ever get into the third tower? After three sisters? I don't think we did. I need to test it out sometime. Am I going to get attacked again if I go here? Does not look like it. Alright. I will get attacked if I go this way though. Wow, we actually ran into a load time. I haven't seen that up until this point so far. Get down here, you. So, how the hell do we reach this? I thought this amounted to fire, but I hardly feel a thing. I have to head further down. That is potentially at the end of the river here. Along this path. Or perhaps Alexander is saying that he had a lot of fire resistance and he was able to head further down. Maybe we can go down there, down that river, outside the guest hall. I think what I'll try first is heading through here because we ran into a steam wall and I pretty much turned around at that point. I didn't try going further. Let me see if we can get through there, but if not, maybe we can go down somehow from the guest hall. So yeah, going this way, I ran into an enemy or two. I don't remember what they were. I didn't get this far. Because otherwise I would have made a beeline for that. Maybe something has changed with the shard bearer's death. Is that a fog wall? It looks like a fog wall. Uh, so we can either head towards the Erd tree or to our left or inside that fog door. Oh god. Where are all these death leeches, whatever they're called? He's unequipped the bow. Not until I get my endurance back up. Actually, wasn't expecting that. So I know where I am, roughly speaking. The other area I need to check out is the grave, the Gelmir's grave, to see if the lava has gone down there. I'm carrying a lot of fire-resistant material in the form of that shield and some other stuff, so maybe... Maybe some new paths have opened to us. We need to... I have plenty, but I always feel antsy about using two. Kick me out while I was trying to look. 
We have 13 left. The Seethe Water Cave. We are, as always, being blocked from teleportation, and this is a drop. And we can't get back up. So at the moment, there is no way out. No way out unless we take out the boss or find a teleporter. More drops. And poison. Grace. I'm gonna get poisoned, I may as well just get it over and done with, right? Came from there, stood on that for a while. Saw you. Looks like we have three paths. The right path is nothing. The middle path is something, perhaps. Left path may take me back up. Ah, no Runox. I don't know if there's something to my left, I'll find out in a sec. This looks bad. Right, there's a dude up to my top left. There's maybe one up to the right as well. Oh boy. So ahead of me, there must be a way up. And then we can go back down, but at the moment, it just looks like we're going down. Secret passage. Ah, oh, so many poison swamps. Okay, this looks like it might be promising. It might go back up. Yep, here we go. Three of them, really. And more. Shit, I thought we were done. Okay, we can just drop down there. I thought there was another item up here. 
You look alive, but I was just there, wasn't I? Alright. Three in here. At least. And then some. No, don't do that. Poisoned, I may as well do it. There's no reason to wait. We have mushroom armor. Lovely. Check that out in a bit once I stop dying. Alright, hopefully that is it for that little subsection. So we go this way, we fall down again. I previously went that way, which led to the rats and led upwards. That looks like a stake of America. And that looks suspiciously like the path to the boss. And that looks suspiciously like a secret passage. But it's totally not. Opportunity required ahead. Love the way he's gesturing as well as if to say, yeah, I need to think about this. Alright, let's go down here. So far below the ground. Okay, boss door. Boss door. I'd like to summon my mimic here before going in, but it shouldn't be necessary. It really shouldn't. Kindred of Ross. Is that what these things are called? Oh god. Yeah, the range attacks on these things are ridiculous. In immediate hindsight, I'm extremely glad that I used a Mimic Tear. Those things are absolute assholes. From the moment I met them, I hated them. Poisoning or rot in vicinity increases attack power. Raises attack power, blah blah. Rot for the Scarlet Goddess. O Scarlet Blossoms flourish in distant lands and return to us, the unwanted children. We saw something about unwanted children a couple of videos ago. Interesting. Ah, uh, the mushroom mama. I thought that'd do something good for, um... Correction, I'm looking at the wrong thing. That does amazing, amazing things for immunity, actually. That does 44 immunity. And that does 42. That might actually be the best helm for immunity. And it could so be that 102 immunity. Holy shit. That is way better than the Guardian Garb. And it's great against magic and lightning, but not much else. Mushrooms found growing all over the body. These overgrown mushrooms have colonized the torso. To those enraptured by the Scarlet Rot, they are holy vestments that root one to the earth. Yeah, immunity 17. Immunity 13. 
That is really good to know, and that would have been useful many, many videos ago. Okay. Let's get out of here, and let's keep going up river. That was two keys to open, so we got that talisman, but we also got that set of armor. I think that set of armor could be very useful in certain circumstances. In fact, maybe that set of armor is what I need to take down the putrid tree spirits in the war dead catacombs. I still feel way too... God damn it. I still feel way too weak to get through those catacombs, but maybe that'll help against the boss. Come on. Just die. Even more of them. How many runes did they give me? Not worth the effort. This does take us here. Wow, okay. I thought I would actually have to go down the uh, river of lava further up. Now we can just follow this dry river bed here. If indeed that's what we can call it. The Seathwater Terminus. Lovely name. Got another one of those giant heads over there. Jellyfish. Two war camps outside this great building here at the base of whatever you would call this. The River Delta, the Terminus. Is it really a Terminus though if we're going uphill here? It's firing its cigars and running me over and I'm almost dead. Holy shit. Come here, you. Okay, this one's being annoying. Come here, you. One thirteen each, not worth it. Anything nice? Yes.
I don't recognize that armor. You were using fire magic, which we've seen before in Limgrave or Lernia. It was Lernia. But I don't recognize this armor set in particular. Fire Monk Greaves. The Fire Monks. We didn't see any around Volcano Manor either, so I do wonder if they are estranged. Um, yeah, you know what, let's go inside. Fort Laid. Smo? Smo's cousin? I'm not even trolling. I love that design. Man, his wife must love this guy. Just keeps going and going and going. Okay, he's now extinguished. He needs a rest. There we go. Prelates Infernal Crozier. I think that's how you pronounce it. Some sort of axe or... No, it's a hammer. No, it's a colossal weapon. Colossal hammer with the appearance of ro roiling flames. Weapon the, of the prelates who lead the fire monks. Its heft represents the weight of their guardianship. The hammer's head is unusually substantial, and strong attacks will fling foes into the air, and it requires 45 strength. We can't equip that. C level strength though, and 152. Decent base, decent base. I assume that door was locked from the other side. Lucid chest. That's near. Don't know what triggered that. saying that. Thought it might have been someone disguised as something. Unless it's the chest itself. It's the chest itself, isn't it? No? directly ahead. Ah, oh, yeah. Decently hidden. Sure you will. Alright, is that it, or are we still going to get this message? Nah, that looks like it was it. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else around here. And if not, then I think we'll start assassinating people.
needs to die right now. Okay, good. Yep, we're good. That could have gone very, very wrong. Hmm, so what I can see, I think that's it for the fortress. It's literally just that one room, followed by the stairs going up to the rampart. getting a summon possibility here. Probably for that thing. I was wondering if he would run into Alexander here. Dismount, please. Yeah, that's one way of dismounting, I guess. Oh god, I'm gonna die. No, not that. Jesus. Oh, this one's fairly chunky, actually. I might have to pay attention on this one. Okay, go bug my AI partner for a bit. Risky. Ah, uh, maybe not. Another dragon heart, which we could. Never mind, the game's saying it for me. Alright. It looks like we can go further in there. Be directly ahead of me. Um, let me just swap my shield over to this other small one. It specifically talks about great resistance to fire. And let me see if I can in increase my fire resistance somehow. In any way possible. Just because I want to have a wander around here. Load be damned. No, not that. Look at the wrong stat. Yes, yeah, so Lionel set along with that helm may be the way to go here. Just so I can walk through the lava and, you know, not die. Oh wow, we've got all of Lionel Cess on except for the helm, and we're at medium load. What about the helm? The helm's gonna keep us on medium load. Interesting, so I could potentially use that set, and that would give me great physical defense. It just means I'm a fatty boomba. But even with this, it doesn't seem to be doing terribly much. Oh, mountain of fire. Bake me in your flames. There we 
There he is. I think I'll heal before I speak to you. Ah, good lady. What business might you have in such a place as this? I hardly think you're here to temper yourself with flame, considering that fleshly form of yours. Your timing, though, is as impeccable as ever. I've been making just the thing for you on my journey here. Take it. I'm sure it'll suit you. Make it quick, I'm burning here. A jarhead. No, it's hardly more than lukewarm here. I won't be able to temper my body such that it'll never crack again. Perhaps I'll head eastward. There's an old saying I've caught wind of. Above the lofty clouds, the icy giant's peak doth soar. Make it quick. Here lieth the flame of the moon, which ever burns. Yeah, that's where I'm going next. I need to quickly just drink some potions and then we'll talk again. Perhaps I'll head eastward. There's an old saying above the lofty clouds. Yeah, that's where I'm going next. Or it's where I'm going once I've assassinated all the other tarnished. Yeah, I know there's more I can do. I can use a consumable liver or whatever to reduce my fire damage, but we'll be fine. We'll be teleporting out of here very shortly anyway. Oh, hello. I see you there. I see you, and therefore you have to die. Oh, there's a lot here. Whoa. Ah, uh, give me a potion back, please. Thank you. Oh, we're heading around there. Okay, okay. Oh, that's not what I wanted to say. God damn it. Uh, lies ahead. Is that the church van? No, that's Renner's Rise. And that's the Three Sisters. I really don't know if those messages are telling me to do something or whether it's just to admire the view. I suspect it's just the view. There was something on the right here. It totally is. And there's also something on my left which I need to grab, and then we'll explore those graves and anywhere else. You're right there, Torrent. So we can either go that way around to the left, or we can go this way. I suspect they're going to come out in the same... same place. Yep. We can either come from there, or from where I just came from, but we have a graveyard. Anything nice? No, just a bunch of coffins and a bunch of low-level runes. Another summoning pool, though, which um, doesn't bode well. It's another one of these things with light coming out of it. I 
I'm certain that's not nothing. I've seen one of those elsewhere, don't remember where, but there's one of those at Stonevale. Hermit's shack, but there is no hermit here. He's either dead or I just killed him. In the reality that I believe in, I believe I just killed him. Whoa. Rune bear? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's not fair. Since why do the bears have range attacks? That took a lot of stamina. Holy sh- Oh shit. Yeah, I really don't want to die right now because I'm holding in excess of 111,000 runes. Shit, that's death. Ah, uh, maybe not. If I can hit again, that is death. And I just realized I have the wrong shield. That's probably why I'm still at medium load. That's also why I'm taking damage while I'm blocking. Holy shit. Everything's going comically wrong right now. Oh, it's been nice, but I can't bear you. Let me get out of here. Heavy load, heavy load. We are now officially a chunky boy. Two potions. It should be fairly easy to get back here if I die. Famous last words, as always. Do you see that? I'm actually locking and I'm not taking damage. What a concept. That's potentially why I was taking so much stamina damage. Although those are still hurting a lot. One more art. Oh. Dude, come on. That's cheating, and you know it. Yeah, not worth it. 2,000 runes, that is not worth it. one potion, but I needed it. going to so much effort to take those things out. Uh... Okay. It's fine, you'll be back in a sec. And then you will die. And you'll give me lots of potions. Nice. Oh, shit. Oh, well, at least you were easy. Alright, nothing in that shack. Alright, come here, you. 
Can I hit this thing from down here? That's how we get to this area. All the way from the river. And we have a side of grace. Pulley crossbow. I imagine that's better than the arbalast that I've currently got. But we've got that one as well, which we pulled out of uh, round table, which I've not been using. They don't have any stat scaling. Wow. Pulleys and power springs. The complex mechanism, which required advanced mathematical and mechanical understandings craft, was likely made by a certain genius who learned Golden Order fundamentalism. One touch fires a volley of volts. Volley of volts. Bolts. Whatever. Be warned, large stores of bolts can be quickly spent. It's similar to that other bow that I've um, picked up. They can fire multiple. Maybe that thing? No. I don't know. Either way, I need to rest here and I need to put another point into endurance. Ninety-four thousand. Let me just fix my armor. No, not that. I'll switch back to the axe armor. And let's have a look around this currently unnamed place. We're at the Craftsman's Shack. The Craftsman must have created that crossbow. Sword is missing a lot today. Come here. Ah, shit. Why do you have one of these things all the way out here? At least this one's weak. Is that an enemy up ahead? Yeah, its cloth is moving. It must be alive. The Hermit's Village. We had the Hermit's Shack before, but now we're in the Hermit's Village. I have a philosophical question. Can there be such a thing as a hermit village? Because, yeah, you could have multiple hermits, but if the hermits get together, are they actually no longer hermits? Oh, God. 
I'm sorry, everyone. You're beautiful. Jesus fuck. I imagine those are either key items that you need to use at some very specific points to make things happen, or you just use them in PvP or whatever to communicate. I might actually look that up later for reals. Don't recognize that. Because we only went down there very briefly. More Starlight Shards? Yep. Can we craft those? We can't, and they're so rare. We only see them around these half moon thingies. Demi-human Queen Maggie. No, you're not. You're Vicar Amelia. Let's clean out your ads first. And yes, I have read the notes. I don't trust the notes. playing this well, but it's fine. I'm over level for this. Yet yeah, literally looks like Vicar Amelia. It really does. Anything nice? Again, I will never use that. Oh, hello. Nothing else. So it's weird, unless there's another way of getting up there, which I don't think there is. It's weird that the Magma Worm boss is significantly more dangerous than that one. Okay, we're looking at the broken bridge ahead of us. This way leads back to the grave. Which is pretty much where I want to head next. I really don't know if I've missed something in there or not. There was nothing else in there other than taking the lava path down, though, which we did. And there was then a little passage to the side. You know what? I'll skip it. I'll skip it. I'll give this some more thought, but otherwise I think we are done with um, Mount Gilmere. Apart from the fact that, you know, we've got a whole bunch of tarnish to murder, so let's get on to that. Uh, the next one was on the Elsa's Plateau, wasn't it? Yep, right there. So, let's go here. 
And what I'll do is jump outside the ramparts, head up the hill. We'll invade that world, kill him, and then head back to the manor. And then have a chat to the NPCs again. So the summon sign should be right about here. Right where someone has conveniently placed a message. Why would you do that? Hey, dude. See, that's the sort of PvP that I like. So, maybe when we come out now, we'll get a armor set. Maybe. Rapus Vile, that's a talisman. Eliminates all sound made by the wearer during movements. A ritual implement used by Round Table Hold assassins. He was an assassin of the Round Table Hold. Interesting. There was a time when Tarnished, who had strayed from Guidance Field, nothing more than utter silence. Those two combined would be great for a stealth build. If such a thing is actually possible. Okay, we need to report our success. I note that Sunita, or whatever her name is, has disappeared. Uh, bell bearing? What on earth? Tonic in a small brass vial. Banishes distress and bitter memories. Oof, if only I could have that. A gift bestowed by Rocket, sworn to blasphemy, to Lady Tanith, who unfortunately had no use for us. My lord, there could be no greater distress than to forget you. Hmm. We've got all of these key items here. I mean, we know what to do with that. Still don't know what to do with those. We saw something about the grapes um, near the Tower of Madness. Might be related to the talisman that we picked up and the um, Kindred of Rot. So I know what that's related to. I, I've got no idea where this stuff's going to come into play. Whether it's part of obscure quest lines or what. Oh dear, what's happened here? Dialos is gone. Rhea is gone. I have a new sword. Poison build up. That's interesting. Sinister katana modeled after a serpent bone. The densely packed row of spines that just away from the cutting edge are coated in a lethal poison. Yeah, look at that. You've got the sharp edge at the top, 
And then on the back of it, you've got the frigging... How does that work? I guess you stab it into people and then withdraw it and it sort of soars itself on the flesh as it comes out. Please don't try and visualize that. But you're still here. So, you killed Rikard. Indeed. I harbor you no ill will. The strong take. Such is our code. Even he was prepared to meet a wretched end when he first took blasphemy unto his very flesh. But any road, the Volcano Manor is no more. Though we may yet fulfill an old promise. We hunted our own kind and took what was theirs. And with everything in hand, the time has come to rise against the Erd Tree. Oh, greater will, hear my voice. I am the recusant Bernal, inheritor of my brother's will, and you will fall to my blade. We refuse to become your pawns. Consider this fair warning. Oh, greater will, I am the recusant We refuse. Hmm. We have no more contracts, and I wonder if I've managed to abort this storyline early by taking out Rikard and speaking to Tanith. Let me just teleport back here and see if anything changes. If he leaves or if he comes back, if anyone comes back, we'll have a look at the map as well to see if I can see Rhea on the map anywhere. He's gone. We have no more assassination objectives. Alright, are we going to get invaded if we go upstairs? One last time. Old time's sake, one last time, one last invasion. Apparently not. I'm the Lord of Volcano Manor now. Or the Lady, rather. Put my feet on the tables, I can do whatever I like. Alright, enough. Uh, do I see anyone on the map? She's not there. And if they are marching to war against the Earth Tree, then I would expect them to be outside the capsule somewhere. Where was that? Oh, that was next to the uh, sending gate. Gold mask is still there. That's the hermit. That's the dung eater. Alright. Let's take a very quick look at round table hold. See if anything has changed there. I also want to hug fear. Because... I need to see exactly what that debuff is doing, and I've read somewhere that hugging her is a way to progress her quest. I know, I shouldn't be reading. I do very little reading. D is still here. Gideon Ofnir is still here. Yeah, I've still got nothing for you. The Dung Eater's room is still empty. Roger, 
Rogier is still dead and his chair's been removed. Greetings. Are you here for I am not. Well, I took you no matter it's all day out your arms then. I imagine the serpent blade weapon is going to require somber stones. If I can find it. No, it doesn't. I'm going to try this thing out. Invest those in there yet. Also, what about my black bow? That's really the only one that I'm equipping. So that thing does 304 plus 293. C and B. Thing just doesn't seem anywhere near as good, but it's got Dex B. And it weighs so much less. What's that icon on the right? Um, just on the right of FP cost 6 12. It's got an icon on the right there. It's present on these three swords, but it's not present on the others. It looks pretty intimidating, honestly. Alright, fear. Let me check my HP. At 1722 HP. Let's see how this works. I am pleased. Would you like me? Now, come closer. While we're snuggling, let me tell you about the time I murdered your champions. Yeah, I was just bathing in a lake of fire, lady. Oh. I was known as a deathbed companion. Where I come from, after I received the warmth and lively vigor from a number of champions, I lay with the remains of an exalted noble to grant him another chance at life. Malika? To do so is the purpose of my being. But before I could bear the noble into new life, I was awakened by the guidance of grace and chased from my birthplace. Pray, be kind. Despite all that, I still wish to be a deathbed companion. So please, let me hold you like this as often as it takes. My dear, have you ever heard of Black Knife Prince? Dear Roger likes to talk of them when abed, and the ancient plot in which the first of the demigods was slain. Not of Black the Knives. The Black Knives wielded by the assassins who committed the act, along with the impressions they made somehow hide the truth of the conspiracy. These grand affairs are hardly my forte. But dear Roger began to weep as he spoke. In truth, I've heard tell from someone else about the Black Knife Prince that fascinate dear Roger so. Rennie? Oh.
Hang on, that looks like um, where I was about an hour and a half ago. The Black Knife Catacomb. Yeah, we've been there. That was the one where there was a secret boss. We've been there. But it wouldn't be right to give this to him. Stuck as he is in the round table hole. Perhaps you could make use of it? I think I can make more use of it because, um, you know, um, he's, uh, he's dead. All right. 1722 has gone down by almost 100 HP. Holy shit. So if I use this thing now, if I can find it, it should be here. There you are. Uses FP to temporarily boost poise. That only lasted about 15 seconds. Maybe a few more. And I do get all of my HP back. That's good. I am pleased. Would you like now? Yeah, I need to basically drain my HP to speak to you. But I can get it back easily enough. And honestly, that item doesn't seem worth it. You are so Unless it has a very specific usage. My dear, might I ask something of you? Could you please find the owner of this dagger? Whoa. And return it to them? <laughs> The Weathered Dagger. A certain person gave it to me as a gift. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place in the owner's heart. So I would like for the original owner to have it back, if you wouldn't mind. I'd like you to find the owner of the dagger I gave you and return it to them. It's a very precious thing. It must have a special place in the owner's heart. Do you want me to give the dagger back to them, or do you want me to plunge it into their heart? Dear Roger, the ancient plot the black man along with... Then good day to you, my dear. So many key items. Dagger received from Fear, the deathbed companion. She wishes for it to be returned to its rightful owner. It was once a special weapon of gold and silver intertwined, but is now worn down and marred by a black gash. Well, okay, that um, doesn't help me at all. Who the F would this dagger belong to? I mean, there's an excellent chance I've killed that person already. Greetings, are you here for sleep? Hugh, can you tell me anything about this dagger? Gideon, you know everything. Literally. Can you tell me anything about this dagger? Well, if you had, you'll need to forgo if you're too thin. D, can you tell me anything about this dagger? Did you need? Oh! Well, what have we here? How did you get your hand on that dagger? The lady in that room gave it to me. Simple as that. Well, that hardly matters. I know very well whose dagger it is. Oh, okay. Why don't I return it to them for you? Good work. Bringing this to me. We didn't have an option to say yes or no, so I assume that's the right thing to do. I am pleased. Would you like me? No, not right now. What I might do is teleport back in and see if things change. I was going to ask Finger Reader Area, Enia, whatever her name is. He's gone. D is gone. Um, if she knew what it was, but...
Right, there's only one place I can think of going right now. Greetings, you hear this? Well, I took you from that man to lay out your arms then. It's looking mighty lonely in here now. That lady's not here. No, Dungy is not there. Husks are still here because, of course, they are. Get in. Do you know where everyone? Nope, you don't know anything. All right, I have to go here. I absolutely have to go here. If I can find it. Fuck, where was it? Down here. Fear's champions were here. She's got to be here, surely. She is not here. Can't mount torrents. Damn, I really thought she would be here. She might be at the sanctuary in Kaled, or the Dragon Barrow, because D also went missing as well. This is where we fought her champions. Could they be somewhere else in Roundtable, perhaps? That seems incredibly unlikely, though. I have one death route to hand over anyway, so let's check this place out. I can't target him, that's good. My thanks. Tarnished. Death. My sin. Should not be touched by the hand of man. I shall grant thee. My claws feed me more. A weapon or an incantation? An incantation, and that doesn't look like claws to me, that looks like a stone. Uh, Fear? D? You out here? Guessing that is a no. Right, let me just confirm that this map is pointing exactly to where I think it is. Yeah, it has to be. It has to be. There's no way it's pointing anywhere other than here. Yeah, that matches. 100%. That little cr outcropping there. And we've been down there. Maybe we need to go back down there to see fear, perhaps. Let me take another look at round table and just confirm that there's nothing here. Hang on, D said he was going to return the dagger, so that would explain where D is. Doesn't explain where fear has gone. And no one around here is willing to tell me anything.
Never mind. Helm depicting entwined twins of gold and silver. The two known as D are inseparable twins. There's two of them. They are of two bodies and two minds, but one single soul. Not once do they stand together, not one word do they speak to one another. Perhaps this armor longs to find its way to the other D. Well, it's pretty much objectively worse than what I'm currently wearing. Where is it? Why is less though? Yeah, that's death in more ways than one. Fear, do you have anything to say about this? Finally, it is returned to its rightful place. The stolen Hallobrand of the exalted noble. And now, I must bid you goodbye as well. Though I ask you deliver this message to the round table hold. We're right here, lady. I am Fear. Deathbed companion, hark round table. Disturb not the death of Godwin, the exalted. We, who humbly live in death, live in waiting. To one day, welcome our Lord. What right does anyone have to object? Our Lord will rise. The Lord of the many and the meek. I assume that you're referring to Malekith. There were two Ds. Does she think that that D was an imposter or something? Well, I took you, Mamad. Lay out your arms. I assume we need to deliver this message to get in. Should wait. Well, I've got runes. Let's do that. I've only got one plus eight. I'll hang on to it for now. Yeah, I assume we just need to give it to this fellow here. I have a message. I'd like to deliver this message to someone. Anyone, please. Let's drop that off. How many shops can we access here? Holy shit. Um, we've got everything there though, so it's fine. Okay, we can purchase up to four here, so we could level up any of our weapons that we like up to four. I keep thinking about purchasing this stuff, so you know what? I'm going to do it now. Okay, so... She's got to be here now, surely. Surely she has to be here. It's of Death's throne. This is where I slaughtered your champions. Ah, there you are. I knew you would come. What is it you intend? To deny us and our ways, like the dogmatic brutes of the Golden Order? It's complicated. Ah. Uh... You are an odd one. I am the guardian of those who live in death. They call me a foul and rotten witch. Yet you still wish to be held by me? Maybe I can stab you with my helmet or something. Have 
you ever seen a Hallowbrand? When the first of the demigods died, his flesh was marked yes, with the half-wheel wound of the centipede. Godwin's Hallowbrand has since been recovered at the Round Table Hold. But there is another Hallowbrand out there We've somewhere. got it. And I must find it before the time comes we receive our Lord. We've got that. We found that at the top of the, uh, which one was it? The Lernia Tower. After we did Rennie's quest, we got the hourglass, we went up there, went up that tower, and the two fingers weren't there. There was Rennie's corpse, we think, and, um, there was that brand up there. When Godwin died, a hollow brand scored his flesh, but another exists. Another mark in the shape of the half-wheel wound of the centipede. And I must find it. Before the time comes, my hands will be dirtied once more by the deed. Will you still let me hold you? Even then? Oh shit. Oh shit. This is the other Hallowbrand. How did you... Oh, my utmost thanks. With this, Godwin can take his rightful place as first of the dead and claim a second, illustrious life. You are my, our, true champion. I already killed Godwin and again, I though. I can't be of any use to you. Can I hold you tight? If only for a moment. Just don't snap my neck, please. I will soon lay with Godwin. And it will surely stir within me. The new life of the Golden Prince, and first dead of the demigods, as the rune of those who live in death. Please, do one thing for me. Brandish this child, my rune, and take for yourself the throne. Stay the persecution of those who live in death. Alternate ending. Coming, our Elden. Alternate ending. I will soon to conceive what rune? My rune stay by become. The blessing you just gave me? Again, it is only a, um, it's only a single consumable. I will to concede. Brandish, stay that I become. All right, let me reload this area. See if she moves. She's still there. Nothing anymore. I don't think this is going to be anything different. I think we might have to do some more stuff. To get her to do something new. Well, you know, maybe this we could just. Is, but I am satisfied. I choose to lie with Godwin of my own will, not the remains of one chosen for me. And I will bear a child who will inherit your warmth too. What greater blessing could there be but to be born a deathbed companion? This is goodbye, my dear. But I am. I choose, and I will who will inherit. What great. You say it's goodbye, but you're still here. I'm just gonna use that blessing again so I can get my HP back. I don't think this one is taking away HP. Okay, she's now dead. Uh, 
Oh shit. Did we just start a boss fight? What the fuck? Uh, I was expecting something, but I wasn't expecting a dragon. What? A lich dragon. What? Fortisax. What the actual fuck is this? Is this like an endgame boss? Suddenly thinking I should have my other sword equipped. Okay, lightning defense may be good against this guy. So far away, I can't even lock onto him. Okay, he is taking poison chip damage from that, that's good. But, um... Oof. I'll give that another go really quickly, but we might need to change our equipment for that. Lich Dragon Fortisax. Is this a child? No, surely not. I've got no fucking idea what's going on. Alright, I need to drink that. Touch you. The Deathbed Dream. Almost sounds like a hunter's dream. Come on, time's are wasting. Just touch her. I was not expecting to get just dropped into a boss battle. What the actual hell? I was expecting something, but not that. Here's got the same idea as me. This thing's just too big. Poison's worn off. Damn, that attack. That might be death. No? Maybe? Okay, Mimic Tears down. I see, so if I've got that lightning on me, I need to start rolling. Or running. That whoa. I just got fucked up. Um he used like a sort of ring of death around me, then jumped up, spewed fire everywhere, and I went down very, very quickly.
Wow. So first question, can I equip the other sword? And I've just realized I didn't equip, didn't get my runes back, but it's fine. However many I had, I'm going to lose plenty more. That is my philosophy. Where are the curved great swords? My god, I've got so much shit here. Where is this weapon that I've been rocking for the entire game? I can't even see it. That's how, how that's how much fucking shit is in this game. It's not that far down. I can't even see it. For reals. I'm looking for the image and I cannot see it. There it is. After the omen cleavers. Yeah, I can equip that and the other one at the same time. So I'm thinking what I'll do is I'll open with the katana. Maybe poison him. And then switch back to the other sword. Why is fear leading me to a battle with a dragon? There's poison now, so let's finish that combo. Switch swords. Try not to die. That fire attack. Let's build up some bleed. Jesus. That's dead. Almost. Okay, the poison is still going, I think. No, the poison stopped. It won't matter, it's almost down. Unless it uses that desperation attack again. Yeah, it's down. Legend filled, and that actually dropped a remembrance, similar to the uh, Ancestor Spirit. Legend, same as Godric. So what just happened? Did Fear basically give birth to that dragon, and that dragon was what they were going to use to take down the Earth Tree? Uh. No, wait, that's her rune. The Mending Rune of the Death Prince. I also have 90,000 runes. I need to think about spending those immediately. Uh, 4,000? Dragon was protecting the rune? I... Uh, I'm gonna need to look that up. Once I'm done with this game, oh, I've got a lot of stuff to look up. So I am actually interested in the lore, believe it or not. Ooh, something else. Fear's hood and fear's robe. Hood of black cloth that covers the whole head, worn by Fear, the deathbed companion, on her journey after being exiled from her home. The fabric itself is soft as silk. Soft as silk and thin enough that those embraced can feel every pulse, every bit of her warmth. And now she's dead. 
I'll take a look at that rune very shortly, but I do wonder whether we need to activate that thing. It's not a great rune, so... I don't expect we'll need to use a certain tower for this. Fear's Mending Rune. Where is it? Rune just dated by Fear, the Deathbed Companion. Used to restore the fractured Elden Ring when brandished by the Elden Lord. Alternate ending! Formed of, of the two Halibrand half wheels combined, the centipede wheels, it will embed the principle of life within death into order. The Golden Order was created by confining destined death. Thus, this new order will be one of death restored. That is a million percent an alternate ending. I don't need to look at the guide to know that. But I do need to speak to Gideon and the Finger Reader to see if they have anything to say about this particular turn of events. That lady is still not there. There are four Mikola of Mikola, the twin, Melania, Prince and, and the Lord of Blood. I assume we're going to run into a couple of those on the mountain top. Uh, about your golden order, lady. I wish I could equip that thing. Where is it? It's a Lich Dragon. Two incantations. And they both require 46 faith to use. 47 there. Storm of Death Lightning. Channels the power of the ancient dragon Fortisax, now corrupted by death. Is that the one that we saw coming up the coward's routes from the ancient plateau? From the Atlas Plateau, rather? It is said that this golden lightning was wielded by Godwin, who befriended Fortisax. During the War of the Ancient Dragons, these twin red lightning stakes were the hallmark of one ancient dragon. It was called the Mightiest Boulder Stone. I've got to start using these at some point. Um, there's one more thing I want to check out before we go up towards the path of Rold, and that is where is where are the other two mausoleums? Where am I? I have no idea what I'm looking at. That's Limgrave. Because we took out two mausoleums here. And I really don't know what we can use them for. use these maybe to duplicate the other ones. Oh, I can. That makes very little sense, but okay. So I can use these two and the other three to duplicate the five and the two respectively. But I can't duplicate them all by the looks of it unless I find some more mausoleums right quick. <laughs> 